Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today's video is going to be a boots haul. So over the last month, give or take, picking up bits from boots, putting them aside because I wanted to share them with you guys. There is quite a lot of stuff I didn't realise um, until I think I looked this morning. I was like, I need to stop. Let me do this haul and then yeah, because <laughs> I need to stop going in there. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to go straight into it because there's quite a few things I need to get through. I've got like a little bag which is full and I've got this bag which is actually kind of heavy and then I've got some bits next to me on the side. Um, so I'm going to start with the things next to me actually. Um, I picked up some protein powder. This, I don't even know how much it should have been but I've got it for like £3. Um, it's still in date and everything um, but yeah, I was just like, okay. And this is the one I wanted to get anyway. So it's like Happy Days, £3. Um, See, so yeah, I picked up another one. This one was uh, £3.25. Um, so yeah, again, this is still in date. So yeah, I'm going to be absolutely good with this. Really sorry if you can hear a motorbike. Someone in the area is beside and literally for the last, I've been wanting to film this for like the last 20 minutes. I've been trying to every time I go to film. I really keep doing that. It's really nice. Um, but yeah, anyway. I uh, also picked up some Epsom salts. These were half price. These were down to 2 99 um, This has uh, white bullet and eucalyptus in. Um, doing some of the workouts lately at the home ones. My body has been dead. Um, so yeah, I thought to get some of these, have a nice soak. So yeah, that's them. Um, oh, I'm pretty careful with them because they're already open and the thingy bit doesn't do it properly at the top. Um, next is the Isla, 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 yeah, is the Lash Tint and the Brow Tint. So I mistakenly picked up the Lash Tint thinking it was the Brow Tint, which it wasn't. And I thought, Do you know what, I'm just going to keep them both. Um, got them in dark brown. Um, yeah, I think they were 9 99 each, give or take. Um, but yeah. I need to die, definitely do my eyebrows soon. Because I've got like a random patch here, I think it's this brow, um, that goes really light at the top of the arch bit. Pretty weird. So yeah, going to spend an evening doing my eyebrows, doing my lashes, probably do a face mask. Might even have a bath with the Epsom salts. Who knows? Um, so yeah, got them. Um, I'm a bit curious with the lash tin, so we'll see how we get on with that one. Maybe I'll do a video trying to do that all my, my thoughts on that. Um, but also get so picked up some of the fresh and fruity mango and papaya shampoo and conditioner. I think they're over a pound or 75p each. I thought, you know what? Why not? I was in I didn't need shampoo and conditioner, but I still bought some. Which everyone does this. You buy stuff you don't need. See, I've got these. How do you even smell them? Oh, that's going to smell nice. Okay, I might use that soon. <laughs> um, yeah, so that was them. Then I picked up an Imperial Leather Shake Your Bamboo Tea <laughs> um, shower gel. Just, oh, I don't know if you're going to see about this. I don't know. Um, oh, this. Oh, that smells like something, but I don't know what. It smells like a sweet of some sort. I don't know. But yeah, that was only a pound. That. Um, so sorry. <laughs> uh, some Ben Fresh, you know, hygiene, and you know, down there, just you know, make sure things good and your pH levels are balanced. Um, along with that, I've got the spray. You know, just that. Now, these weren't full price, they were like a third off, but I've lost the receipt exactly how much they were. Um, but yeah, I would say about 2 99 each ish or something. I really hope you can't hear that so loud. I'll stop that. Um, got some actual deodorant. This was in the three for two, you know, like the miniatures. This was a part of that. So I got this one free because it was only a pound. But I did actually get big deodorant as well. 
because this was half price, I think it was £1.50. Um, the little one I tend not have my gym bag, so it's ideal instead of having a massive can in my bag. Um, what else I okay, so I picked up the Dove Derma Spa, um, basically like self tan, but like the, the body lotion. I think I got this when it was half price because it's supposed to be £7 and I got it for £3.50. Admittingly, I haven't really used it. Um, I don't know why I bought it. I think I just want, I just felt like my legs looked pale, but I just never used it. <laughs> so yeah, I'll probably try that and see if it works. So I've, I've used one of them like gradual tanners before, and like my toes, <laughs> my toes and my knees. Well, no, and I think that's what put me off them. Um, also picked up some just some hand wash care X, the refillable one, so I don't you know you haven't got the whole pumpy bit. Um, so yeah. A pound for that actually. Oh, I've got the Boots Care Exfoliating Foot Scrub, um, semen oils and mint. So I thought, you know, with it being still, I don't know if it's still summer. No, I think summer's done. Um, but yeah, when summer was here, <laughs> before I actually got a pedicure. Before I got a pedicure done, um, you know, I was trying to look after my feet. I've done like a, um, the mask thing, the booty things we put on. Yeah, I've done one of them. I thought I'd get a scrub as well because I've had one previously and I know they do my feet really good. Um, oh, that does smell like really, really refreshing. Um, so yeah, probably gonna have like a pamper night soon with all this stuff anyway. And then along with that, I've got the um, Palmer's Cocoa Butter Heel Repair. Um, it's like a base like the cocoa butter stick. <laughs> yeah, I've actually used it since I bought it, and it's actually quite good. Um, so yeah, it's a heel repair. Are you, are you gonna go away like? Um, so yeah, it softens and smooths dry, cracked heels and feet. And it's got peppermint oil in. Um, apparently to have in your handbag as well. Um, oh, with the three for two, and the miniatures, I picked up this little hand cream. This is perfect for your handbag. It's small enough. I know some of the small hand creams are still quite small, but I find this even better. Um, and you don't need a lot of it. I love this stuff. I think this is 150. Um, and also, I just see this little mini Cantu, although I'm not a fan, a massive fan of Cantu products, um, or some of them because they do leave my hair crispy, but I was like, this is a little curling cream, and I was like, this, the pot is ideal, and if I, once I've finished it, to reuse and put something else in there. Um, so yeah, that is that. Um, that was, I think, 250 So yeah, I'm free for two on that. Oh, something else for feet. Thing. Of feet in any way. Um, is the Palmer's Foot Magic um, Cream. So it deeply moisturises rough and dry skin. So it's got peppermint oil and mango butter. And it's like this. And I will say it is absolutely amazing. This is like my little favourite bag because it's got like beauty stuff in it, like skincare. And I get excited over things like that. Saying that, I've got some hairbands. <laughs> I don't know why I put the hairbands in there, but yeah, they're the little, um, I don't know what they're called. They're just the material. I like have them on my wrist for a long time as well as like a bracelet. Not a bracelet, but do you know what I mean? Like, have that and then. This is hairband at that time. They were, I want to say, two pounds something. I've lost my speed for them. Um, did also, I've been debating to get this for a very, very long time, is the Clinique ID. See that. Um, so, yeah, I spoke to a Clinique agent or skincare advisors um, via their help chat thing. Um, and asked 
like basically what do I need this is my skin what's the best so I've got the because I've got like combination skin but also I have dry patches um, and then also like my skin texture is not all like it's just yeah it's a bit all over the place although my skin probably looks okay at days but then sometimes I look at it and I'm like Ew, no um, so yeah I've got the moisturizer lotion which is the base um, and then the bit that goes in the middle of it I've got the uneven skin texture um, thing which is the blue one and it looks like this I've really been using this um, so yeah literally like you get it and the cartridge this is really, really disgusting. like yeah the cartridge goes in the oops and then once you sort of pump it a couple of times it will just like the lotion will mix with the serum in the, the blue bit and it just comes out all together so yeah that's that and I must say I think this is £36 for the both of them um, so far £36 well spent I never really spent that much on like face cream but you know I've been eyeing this up for a long time so I thought why not treat myself and get it so that was that um, then I've got the boots brightening cleansing gel vitamin C sorry cleansing gel um, so oh god that was really reflected on there yeah it's just oh my god this is actually so bright I can't read it um, so yeah it's basically just a cleansing gel uh, it doesn't dry your skin, it makes your skin look brighter within 14 days massage onto that skin and obviously clean off um, then also picked up a Sanctuary Spa Supercharged Hyaluronic Face and Neck Cream I had one of these before and I used it for when I went away so instead of me taking like a big pot of cream like my face creams I just had a quick little mini one there so yeah that was that which I was, I lost the receipts of that, have I? I've got some receipts, but none of the ones, yep, none of the ones that you actually have to. Oh, what's this one? Oh. Um, the glycolic acid, Boots now do their own pea range, which I was like, oh, it's called ingredient. I love the packaging, it's like, sim like just straightforward, it's pink, and yeah, so, got the glycolic acid which is um, to make the skin look brighter, renewed and appears more radiant. Um, I haven't used this because actually I have just finished one, that's why. So I've used something else at the same time. And I did briefly use this a couple of times, but I thought no, let me finish whatever else I had before. So yeah, that's that. This is this is five pounds. Um, I have noticed their whole range is not that expensive. It's actually quite good um, I think it's like, I'd say £6 and under would be where they're at with their stuff. Along with that, I've got the Sally. Wait, I said this earlier. Sally Silic. Oh, this is going to sound so wrong. Acid. Oh, yeah. You guys know what I mean. Like, I don't know why I'm getting tongue twisted today. I said this so good in my head earlier. Um, but yeah, this is. Um, so basically it's a serum that leaves your skin visibly less oily without feeling dry because I can get oily like in my t-zone you can probably see it, I haven't really any makeup on today um, so yeah I thought, see how I get on with that you can put it on day and night but I just need to check I'm probably going to alternate between like the hyaluronic acid and this one and which days I use certain things on because uh, I know some of them you shouldn't really mix too much but yeah I'm going to once I get around to using it, I'm going to have a look. Um, then I've got actually, my two last things. <laughs> this is literally the last two things. Um, I've got the Boots Glow Cleansing Oil. It comes in this little pink bottle. So cute again. Um, okay, because this light is reflecting and it's quite bright on my face. Um, it cleanses the skin and gives it a healthy looking glow. Um, Yep, you put it on your face, then you rinse thoroughly with water and pack your skin dry. That one. And then we've got, finally, the Glow Mist. Um, it's a brightener mist, so skin looks hydrated and radiant. And with this, 
um, you can use as a wake up boost in the morning or the hydrating fix in the PM. So it's probably kind of no different in my, I can see it, the Neutrogena um, turmeric toner. I think that's the toner. Um, yeah, it's like a hydrating mist. Again, you put it on either after makeup, throughout the day to refresh. So yeah, there's probably something similar along the same kind of concept. Um, obviously it doesn't have the turmeric in. So yeah, that's my very long. There's just a load, literally, I'm just looking at this pile of stuff. I've now got to put all of this away somewhere. I don't know where I'm putting it, but wish me luck in doing so. Um, but yes, guys, if you like the video, don't forget to obviously like it um, and then subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in the next one.